first time you're welcome i know that the energy is not given for an intro it is really not given i'm not even feeling it but i'm tired like it is currently um almost 11 p.m and i'm just coming back from school so i am tired uh, i but i just wanted to start this vlog because i know that my week is going to be a lot of things and I might just pick up my camera when I'm out and stuff. So I wanted to start this vlog. Oh well, by the way, if this is your first time here, you're welcome. If this is your first time seeing my fit pretty face, this is Mara. Welcome. I am a Nigerian who just moved to Canada as an international student. And since then I've been sharing my life here and also tips to help students who want to come to Canada. Right? So do well to make yourself comfortable hundred percent on this channel, okay? So yeah, I just thought to start this vlog right now and um, run you guys, give you guys a brief update about what's going on with my life right now. But I have a lot of good news. I know I don't even look it, like I don't look it, but like I have a lot of good news right now. I am so excited guys. Guess what? <laughs> I just got monetized, like my channel just got monetized. What am I saying? Our channel just got monetized. Like, oh, I want to say thank you. I want to like appreciate every one of you that have subscribed, um, and have watched my videos and have supported me in any way. Thank you guys so much. Um, I don't know what to say, but just thank you. So like, I'm I'm feeling so excited today. I mean, it's just been a good day for me. I'm just excited. My bed is finally coming tomorrow, guys. See, I don't know where to start from. The issues I've had with getting a bed frame since I came here. I used to have one which I sold. But finally, my bed frame is coming in tomorrow and I'm so excited. So, my mattress has been on the floor since I got it and... I don't know like it just doesn't help me to relax my back and stuff even when i want to use my laptop on the bed like it's just so hard because it's on the floor <sighs> i'm tired so yeah i can't wait for the bedroom to get here and i'll show you guys i just wanted to quickly start this vlog so that you know we can now be picking it as we advance for you guys i'm so so happy i want to quickly go do my nighttime routine and go to bed hey guys <laughs> good morning so this is the next morning i just fixed myself coffee you guys, you guys okay i'm just trying to talk to the microphone or talking to the microphone that's why i'm moving my body <laughs> all right so i just finished talking to my mom and honestly it made me realize how much i actually miss home i actually miss home a lot guys like i miss home i miss my friends i miss everything i miss my siblings and stuff yeah but it's all good it's all good 
I just woke up not quite long ago, spoke to my mom. In fact, my mom called woke me up. She won't stop calling me until I beat. And once I beat, I wasn't going to go back to bed. So I just freaked myself early coffee because I need it. It's, um, it's about almost 8 a.m., I think. So I... I'm not working today, rather I'm not working in school today, but I'm working my other job. I have an evening shift at my other job, so I just want to get a few things done in the house, do some assignments that I can, then yeah, go to work. I want to make um, soup, I want to make oha soup or, yeah, oha or vegetable, no, ve- not vegetable, oha or bitter leaf soup, but yeah, I'm going to show you guys. I mean, like filming cooking videos, like the people that do cooking content, cooking content, they try. Oh my God. Last time I tried it, I'm like, I don't think I'll do this. <laughs> you have to move the lights. You have to move the camera. Oh God. It's a lot. And you know, you're cooking, you just have to do everything. Like it's a process. And the time you want to spend putting spices, you're using it to move cameras and stuff. Like, hey, now nah, you guys are trying. But yeah, if I can show you guys, I'll just I'll probably show you guys a bit of it if I eventually cook because I'm not sure. Once I'm done talking to you guys now, I want to sip on my coffee and get on some of my assignments. Then when I'm a bit um, advanced with my assignments, I will then um, cook. But hopefully I'm able to cook. Or if not, I'll just <laughs> forget it because I need to go. Because I have a job training tomorrow and Saturday I'm working and yeah. And then I'm back to next week and I need to have food. So I think that's all about it. I just wanted to, you know, check in on you guys this morning. Yeah, one more thing, guys. So yesterday morning when I was going to school, I got an email or rather I got an SMS from Prairie I don't know if you guys know Prairie Tour. Prairie Tour is like a ship. They move like bigger, heavier stuff, like furniture and stuff. So I, they said I had a package. I'm like... What package you know i bought my mattress from sorry my bed frame from mayfair and i actually thought that it's going to be home delivery because they charge for delivery i didn't know that i still have to go pick it up from somewhere so apparently the bed frame has been here since i didn't even know because i got that message i ignored it because of how much people scam people here in canada you don't click every link and i got a message saying oh i should click the link to track my order i'm like i didn't order anything i'm not expecting anything from prairie so i didn't click it but yesterday i got more curious i said oh this might be an order this looks like it, it's an order i clicked on it and um i saw the order number then i called these things will happen before i spoke to you guys yesterday though then i called the uh, customer care line that i saw there and they said oh that i actually the tracking number is correct i actually have a package with them and i was wondering what package i ordered some months ago i think sometime in the beginning of december i ordered a uh, what's that now winter shoe this winter boots from one company that random company i saw online guys to today those people took my money they didn't deliver they don't reply to my emails anymore but that's not the essence of this video so in my mind i'm like wait maybe it's actually those people but they said the product weighed 61 lb i'm like the boot can never weigh 61 lb so i was worried and i was like the bed i paid for i felt like might weigh more than that so i'm like no it can't also be the bed but now that i've confirmed that it's the bed from them <laughs> yesterday i confirmed rather that i had a package with pure ritual then after i spoke to you guys last night i had to check um my mail with um track my order from mayfair themselves only for me to realize they said oh my delivery should already be in my city that if i'm not if i'm not able to find it i should contact the rate in my mind i'm like oh it's actually the bed so i'm going to maybe pick it up today i don't know if i'm done from work i'm working from 11 um, 1 to 5 p.m right i don't know if i told you guys already so if i'm done from work i might just get a cab and go pick it up i'm not sure if i'm not able to maybe tomorrow after my training but yeah either way we're gonna pick it i just wanted to tell you guys that the bed frame is here and i'm really excited about it i can't wait to see it so i will just quickly study like i already said and i'll talk to you guys 
when I can. Okay, when there's something to talk about or when I'm cooking, I don't know if I'm going to even carry this along because it's going to make that cooking process really long. But whatever, you guys stay tuned and I will update you guys when there is anything for me to eat. Okay, so bye. Girl, I just want me over. Girl, I just want me over. Uh, and girl, I just want me with you like ice water. Damn me, I'm more pushing me, but you spend your money, people. After tonight, I go like this, see you late. I say now, friend, I can't speak cause of you. I get many haters. I'm a girl, wine for your guy. Tell me with you, they fine for your life. My love is broke, me can fight for your life. Rolling with me, me can rule you as I like. Me rule him on rule to set. Every man want to open bonnets. Do you give what you want to call it? So guys, we are about to cook now. You guys already know that when I'm cooking, maybe you've not noticed, or let me just say it, I always like to watch my favorite YouTuber as well. Just watch something while I'm cooking, sometimes vlogs. And this is Lydia Stanley. I love this lady so much. She's inspiring. <laughs> I just love her. She's the only person I can legit watch her. One hour. Lydia puts out two hours vlog. This one I think is about two hours. So yeah, two hours. So as I'm cooking, I'm going to be watching her. I also wanted to show you guys this oil, right? You guys remember the oil? I did not even I've not done videos about how I came to Canada with. I'll probably do that video. I came to Canada with this oil from Nigeria. Okay, I'll tell you guys how I did that in that video. So I have I came with two of it. I've been using this one. Okay, so I'm gonna be using this for the soup. I just wanted to show you guys. That's why I brought the two out. And this is the oha leaf I came with. It's remaining small. I'm just gonna use a bit also to make the soup. Because I'm thinking of doing a cargo soon, but I heard that for cargo, you can't send dry stuff and it's crazy. So yeah, I'm going to take a bit of this right now and let's get into making this soup while I watch Lydia because I love her. Period. <laughs> Alright guys. Hi, the latches bomb milk chew like but you spend your mind people that tonight I could like to see you later. Apparently, I don't have any chicken. I don't have any meat. <laughs> oh my god, I already soaked the hoha. I don't know what I was thinking. I have chicken though. I don't know if that is what confused me. Remember the chicken I used in my last vlog where I made the spaghetti? So I had chicken, but that chicken is a soft chicken. I don't cook soup with soft chicken, right? Do you guys get what I mean? Like, I can't cook soup with soft chicken. Right now, I was done soaking the oha. I brought out all the spices, trying to get, I was just about to get the um, cocoyam powder for the soup. And one mind was just like, okay, what next? To put the meat on fire. And another voice I heard was, which 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 meat? Which which where you keep them? I just started thinking I'm like wait wait so oh, I'm her. Where is the meat you want to use? This is blown working off it. Like so the food has been suspended. Suspended. The soup has been suspended. I can't make it anymore as it is right now. I just have to go back to my studies. So hopefully when I go to pick up the bed i'm able to just branch african store and get hot chicken because who makes soup with soft chicken by the time i'm done cooking that soup this chicken will all melt inside the soup and i don't want that and that's a pre-spiced chicken or something and i don't want any spice to alter the taste the original taste of my food or my soup so i was already in the mood to give you guys see my you guys can see my lights here already i was already in the mood to give you guys tutorial on how to make the banging or hassle but now i can't i have to go back and continue to study but i just wanted to tell you guys that so i'll see you guys in the i'll see you guys later bye <laughs> more music on trendybeats.com
So guys, I'm at the African store. Guys, so I'm a pro editor. Let's see. Trendybeats.com. The code in this country, Jesus Christ. I can't feel my hands anymore. So the bed frame, I just came back. I need to get help to move it to my apartment. Yeah, hopefully gonna move it. And I need to go ahead and make the soup. This is going to have to be here because I'm not gonna set it up today. Tomorrow um I have another meeting at work. Training, right? Tomorrow training. Then on Saturday, I'm going to work. Maybe on Sunday. And I'll show you guys, okay? Right? So, talk to you guys later. Mm.
Like thunder. 